What's crackalacking YouTube? Sock Monkey coming back at you live. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get RTX or ray tracing enabled in Minecraft. First, you're going to want to obviously buy Minecraft. Next, you're going to want to get Xbox Insider Hub and you're going to want to launch this. Go up in here into Insider Content and you'll have something for Minecraft right there. It'll be managed. You're going to want to join the RTX beta. And then once that's done, it's going to say pending, uh, which is going to mean downloading. So then the next thing you want to make sure is that you are in the RTX beta here. Uh, currently, it's version 1.16. All these words up here at the top, they will unfortunately be there. Then to get RTX, you can either go right in here and you'll be able to see ray tracing worlds that you can download. But that is not why you're here. And if the beta did not pop up, uh, one thing I had to do was actually uninstall uh, the Minecraft I had downloaded and re-download it uh, when you go into the Xbox Insider Hub and uh, select to be in the beta. So next what you're going to want to do is come to the Minecraft with RTX texturing uh, where they talk about everything and the guide for everything. And you're going to want to come down to the NVIDIA and Partner Resource Packs. There's going to be four of them. There's going to be the HD Decorative Resource Pack, HD Foundational Resource Pack, Muddle, and Razzlecore RTX. You're going to want to download all four of those. So once you have all four of those downloaded, you're going to have to uh, go through each one and extract the files and put that into the Minecraft location. Up here, you're going to type in percent app data percent enter. And then it's going to take you to roaming and you're, wanting, you're going to want to go back one into app data. You're going to want to go local packages and you're going to want to come down and find one that's Microsoft.Minecraft UWP and then you're going to want to go into local state games com.mojang and then from here you're going to want to click resource packs and select folder. I already did this so I'm not going to do it but um, you're going to want to do that for the other three as well but when you click the other three and extract it should take you to right here so all you have to do is select folder. All right, so once you have all four of those texture packs downloaded, um, come in here and just make sure they are here. I do have one active. You're gonna wanna create new, create new world, survival, normal, whatever difficulty. Come to resource, my packs. Uh, you can click on any one of the four and then go ahead and activate it. So then once you do that, you're just gonna wanna go ahead Double check the settings, make sure everything's good. Go ahead and create. And then after that, it oh, says at least one of your resource or behavior packs failed to load. That's okay though, I guess. After that, you should be good to go. And then once you're in here is when you can go into settings, go to video, and then you can come down and kind of play with uh, the ray tracing and how far you want it to render. So I usually do 16 chunks. And then after that, you're good to go to play. Enjoy guys, thanks, peace.